Okay, here we are at Mingo Point. And this is the big area that we will be setting up a set of pinwheel lights today. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and take our first line. We've laid out our lights. We've plugged them in to make sure they all work. And now we're gonna connect to the far okay, side. So we've, got, we've picked out our rigging point. We got our ladder set up. Now we're gonna take the end of the line and we're gonna put a loop in it. Okay. So he's taking out the end bulb so you don't have two next to each other. He's gonna fold it in half and tie that loop into a knot. And so that loop that he's, that he's put through right there, that's what we're gonna attach the zip tie to. Okay, so we've got our spot in the tree. We've got our market lights. We're gonna attach it with a zip tie. And we're just gonna pull it a little bit to put it on, but we're not gonna make it tight. So at the end of the night, when we need to, to take it down, all we're gonna do is cut the zip tie we won't leave, we'll leave this in the tree and we'll leave that on the lights. We've got our one end in. We've got our market lights going across. Now we're going to put the other end, but we need to figure out how much room we need in those lights so they slack about the right way. So you want to make sure your second man is making sure them bulbs don't slide on anything and pop. So that's probably a good height right there. So he's going to figure out where that is and he's going to pull out one bulb and then tie it in a loop. Okay, so he's picked out which spot. He's gonna pull out the one bulb and then twist it again in a loop for this side. Okay, this will go same as the other one. Okay. You just go ahead and put your zip tie on, leave a little bit of slack. Uh, everything after the attachment, we're gonna take all those extra bulbs out because we don't want those lit up. Okay, so when you go, when you're measuring up your second strand, you want your second strand to just raise up so it's just barely touching the first strand, and that way they'll both be about the same length. Once you measured it out, mark it, pull out the bulb, and tie okay, it. So we've got two, we're going to our third one, testing out the lights. Okay, we're plugging it in, but the lights aren't lighting up. So. Now we need to figure out is the problem the electric cord or is the problem our cord. So we're going to go ahead and switch and plug it into one that we know works and see if they light up. Okay, in this case, the light bulb's lit up. So we know the problem isn't our cord, the problem is their outlet. Okay, once you got your zip tie on, pull all those bulbs out from the center so they don't get slammed together. Okay, so you got your zip tied spot together. Put your base right on the ground. We're going to attach the pole to that center. We'll pretend like that piece of metal is not even there. At the end of the day, we have a lovely set of pinwheel lights at Mingo Point.